The NCAA Beach Volleyball Tournament returned to the Sandcourt Subic Bay Freeport Zone where old and new heroes rose to the occasion for Season 99. It was a success. I'm happy and happy. It's a success in a way that we were able to bring back the high school division and we're thinking of putting a girls division next year. In the women's division, Colegio de San Juan de Letran successfully defended their title after beating Sunbury University 21-16, 21-16 in the finals. The Lady Knights went unbeaten in the event, winning all of their 11 matches throughout the competition. Larame Silva, who won the title alongside Chamberlain Cunada in Season 98, celebrated anew, this time with talented reinforcements, sisters Gia Marcel and Jogi Makila. Yung sabi lang po ni Coach sa akin, parang one game at a time lang po kami. Tsaka mag-enjoy lang po sa loob ng court. Tsaka wala pong pressure. Kung wala naman pong sekreto, siguro sinaga lang po namin every game. Tsaka tinrabaho po lahat-lahat ng game. Tinrabaho na lang po namin yung pagkakanalo po. Gia Marcel Makila took home three awards, namely Freshman of the Year, Rookie of the Year, and Most Valuable Player. Meanwhile, Letran's Michael Inoferio was named Coach of the Year. This was Letran's third overall women's beach volleyball title in league history. Over in the men's division, the University of Perpetual Health System Dalta also went back-to-back -back after repelling Mapua University in the championship match 21-19, 21-13. The Altas once again unleashed the powerful tandem of Louis Ramirez and Jefferson Marapo as they overwhelmed the Cardinals' duo of St. Marlo Hamisola and RJ Ramos. In Season 98, Marapo took home the MVP trophy. This time around, it was Ramirez who was recognized as the most valuable Pressure po pero yun nga lumabas yung pagiging champion team namin ng kasama. Malakas yung pakiramdam namin na kayang-kaya namin mag-champion. Naibigyan namin yung dapat ikalaw ng bawat isa. Hindi namin ninasahan na lahat ng team sobrang prepared. Para sa akin po nakaka-proud po na nanalo ulit kami dahil yun sa akin po kasi last playing year ko na. So yun, all out po kahit ano maya. Sobrang laking bagay po para sa akin. Maraming opportunity pero magiging wise mo na kung saan mapupunta. Perpetual's Maki Carino was named Coach of the Year, while James Harold Marasigan of the Benil Blazers was hailed as the Rookie of the Year. With their victory, the Perpetual Altas are now owners of four NCAA Men's Beach Volleyball Championships, trailing only Benil who has a league-best seven titles. The juniors division saw a finals match that went to a deciding third set as Emilio Aguinaldo College battled LPU. In the end, EAC's Alijan Abdian and Dwayne Iverson Alin Alin triumphed over LPU's Rodan Aguirre and Ace Van Roboel Blanco 21-17, 16-21, 15-10. Sobrang kaba ko po noon, lalo na nung medyo nadadown na po kami. Pero syempre, strategy pa rin po. Then, teamwork, enjoyment, communication lang din po. Pagkaya din po ng turo ng head coach sa amin, si Coach Rod. Malaking thank you po sa kanya dahil tinuro niya sa amin yung lahat ng skills na natutunan namin, lahat ng pagkakakamali namin na nag nagawa namin ng tama. First year ko po na makasali sa Manila, makatungtong dito. Sobrang overwhelmed po. Masaya din para sa team, para sa school. Alijan Abdian was named Rookie of the Year and Most Valuable Player, while Rod Palmero received his award for Coach of the Year after guiding EAC to a record fourth Juniors Beach Volleyball title, the most in NCAA history. I'm happy that not only one school dominated. There was a perpetual for the men, that ran for the women, and uh, made a new team, AYAC, for the boys. Thank you for all those who participated, who supported, those who lost. Better luck next time. The winners, congratulations. And that, mga kapuso, was your NCAA Season 99 Beach Volleyball Recap.